All right, welcome to the review of the Jordan Top 3s. Nike Air is on the back, 2-3 on the side, and our Air Sole Unit. So these shoes represent the fire reds, the metallics, and grapes. This is the Jordan 5. Uh, 11 and a half retro. All right, so let's take a look. So, you got the metallic accents. Primarily the shoes, the metallic, because of the fact that it's black. And you got the fire red soles and the two, three. And of course, the uh, rubber outsoles and our Nike ears. Um, I haven't seen any flaws or defects. Uh, the cushion here is super good. It's not cheap. I like it. This material is good. And these lace biters, they should have been a uh, turquoise like the black piece the, the spring loaded part yep. uh, this is kind of like how the shoe should have been sold should have came with um, purple laces so these go back in the box to most likely never be used again um, but when I was a kid this was my favorite part on the original grapes is this just bottom section? I just thought it was the coolest thing ever. Um, I generally wear a size 12, but uh, these shoes run big. Um, so the Jordan 3s, 4s, 5s run big, uh, and they slimmed down on the Jordan 6, 7. Uh, they got big at 8, uh, true to size at 9. Um, 10, true to size, 11 is actually large, uh, 12, 12 and 5 may be the largest, Jordan 13 slimmed down, 14 uh, slips out in the back heel, so I'm going to probably say those run a little bit big, uh, and I usually stop at Jordan 16, so the 15s those stay on, those are true to size. I would probably go down a size, so whatever your normal size is. And then Jordan 16, which is my favorite pair, uh, are true to size. Uh, but I've always liked the fives. So, um, any other reviews as far as the shoe? Pretty basic, just the normal Nike Air on the inside. Um, yeah, I mean, there should have been a little bit uh, distribution done better on, on all three color choices. There's a lot of people that talk about what's being done here, what's being done here, and, and so forth. But um, with it being like a non-combination shoe where they mix like a Jordan 7 and a Jordan 15 or something, uh, where it's just a, a color scheme of combinations, I mean, it's the first first try, I guess. So I just loved it uh, once I seen it. A lot of people are confused about the shoe, which I've been seeing a lot of comments like, what's this shoe supposed to be? Well, it's, it's a primarily metallic shoe with fire red uh, midsoles and the grape tongue. Um, so they just aren't used to that. And a lot of people pass these up. Um, but yeah, um, the sole inside's cool. It's kind of like an off-white in there. And that's about it, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Make sure you leave any comments uh, at the bottom. Uh, well, actually, it's at the top now uh, on what you guys think. And uh, stay safe out there.